Greetings adventurers, my name is Hope and this is my cat Max be in this video but here she is anyway uh, in this video we are going to be opening the game genic soft crate and the game genic double deck pod They're all created for star wars unlimited so i guess let's get to opening and see what's inside uh, the Game Genic Soft Crate is actually created for your tokens in Star Wars Unlimited. So all those, and there are a lot of tokens in this game. So in here we have, it's kind of like a normal Game Genic deck box. Um, we have the separate, separate compartment inside the crate. And in here, oh, we have a little, oh, okay. Did not see that coming. It's a little case. That's kind of cute. All right, so they don't generally have this in their other deck boxes, but I guess they made something special for Star Wars Unlimited. I think these are to keep your little um, plastic tokens and that, the the life counters and the damage counters and all of that which is actually quite nice because they are your main tokens and you do have a lot of them it's very the pla it's a plastic but it is a flexible plastic so it's going to keep your cards safe but it's also it's got some bend in it all right, that was the soft crate by Game Genic for the Star Wars Unlimited. Now let's move on to the bigger one. All right, now we get to the big guy, the double decker pod. Now this is meant to hold two decks of Star Wars Unlimited. There we go. All right, I got it open. Didn't need that. Thank you, Dad. I can get it open by myself. Ooh, I tore the box. Okay. Oh, this is nice. It just pulls right out. All right, so... Oh, this is fancy. Okay. Double lining. Ooh! All right, this is quite nice. It feels very sturdy. Okay, this, oh, all right. This is very nice. The lid comes straight off. I was not expecting that. I was expecting it to flip open. So the lid comes straight off and it's got a very nice velvety uh, inside. I'll just put that right there. And then inside the box is two compartments. In the front, as you can see, is actually card cases. Which you can display your leader in. Side is okay that doesn't come out but oh okay there are side compartments to this as well uh, on the side you can see there's little sleeve holders uh, I assume to put some more cards in so you can see your bases can go in there And on the side here you can see there is little drawers that come out and I assume to keep more tokens or to keep more cards. Wait, do the cards fit in here? No, the cards don't fit. Okay, so this is for your tokens. Uh, 
as you can see, this is where your decks go, this flips up, everything is has a magnet to it and it is actually quite strong. So you don't have to worry about it falling out. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Put it to the test. Then we just simply put it back on top and I guess we can put it to the test. Yeah, no, stays on nice and tight. This is not a flexible plastic like the token box. Let me just get that back out. Probably shouldn't have put it in the box. There we go. This is a bit more flexible plastic. This is a lot harder. This is like the Game Genic shell. Um, it is sturdy and not meant to go anywhere. Okay, and then we simply close it all up. And I'm going to go and play Star Wars Unlimited now. All right, see ya. There's a nice home to put them in. Oh dear. Wait, okay, I can get it out. And wait, let me get this open. No, I didn't bring a knife. So the cards are neatly in because I was told I need to make it look better because it was bothering my dad that it was so skew. Uh, I couldn't see that. Apologies to everyone else. Also, don't damage your cards. Sorry. It's very, very um, posh. Can I say that? <laughs>